call this pattern Milky Way just because it's made up of lots of stars. This would be good on a patriotic quilt, maybe a kid's quilt. Um, so you're just going to make a five-pointed star. And then you're going to go out to one of the ends of the star and make another star. But you want to orient that other star differently. So go out to the end of the point of the star make another star and you can make the stars whatever size you need to fill up the space so here I'm going to make a fairly big one and then I'm going to go back out to that end put a smallish one in So what you want to do is make them different sizes, different orientations, and it's just drawing a five-pointed star. It's very easy, very simple. And you're just going to cover your surface with five-pointed stars. Let's see, I could stand to sneak a little one in there. It's not a very good little one either, but that's because it's up against the edge. So you're just going to make a bunch of stars, go out to the ends and create stars. Very simple. It's good, for, like I said, for a patriotic quilt. You could do this big so that it's an all over, or you could do it tiny for a filler. All right, this is Milky Way. Milky Way because it's lots of stars. You're going to work at the end of a star point. Make another five-pointed star. Walk yourself out to the end of the star point. Make another five-pointed star. Walk yourself out to a different star point. Make another star. Use the stars you've already done to get over to the spaces you need to fill up. You can make real tiny stars. You can make larger ones. Again, this would be a nice all over for a patriotic quilt, maybe a quilt of valor, uh, especially if you're not a super accomplished quilt